Uh, everything's been good so far. My body's feeling better and better every day. It's nice to get out there and play a couple days in a row. Uh, you do realize you know, how hard it is to play every day uh, when you haven't done it in a, in a few months. But uh, offensively, things feel good defensively. So we're getting back to where I'd like to be. What was it like being in the field for a full nine innings to second base today? Uh, that early in the morning, it was a little tough, <laughs> but it was good. You know, it's hot, and this is a good test for my body just to kind of see where you are in the whole process. And, and it went pretty well today. Everything felt good, a little tired, but but not too bad. What's Obviously the plan today? Obviously, you're swinging the bat very well. I feel good at the plate, uh, a lot better than I would have expected at this point in the in the process. So uh, when it comes to you know offensively, I feel like I'm about ready. I haven't played at Bowie in a long time, but you did come through here once in your career. What's it like being back here at Prince George's Stadium? It's nice, you know. You forget what the whole minor league atmosphere is like, and, and it's fun to fun to be back. You know, you remember your roots and where you came from, and and what you went through to get to where you are. So it, it's great. These uh, the fans here in Bowie have always been great to me, and, and I enjoyed my time here then and, and now. Unfortunately, I'd rather be there, but it's it's good to be here. Thanks a lot, Brian. Okay. What's the schedule for you from here on out? Do you play tomorrow? Or do you um, I'm off tomorrow, and then we're gonna kind of reevaluate tomorrow with the. The, the higher powers in Baltimore. We'll see what they decide to do from there. So you're not sure right now if you will continue playing here at Bowie? I don't know yet. No, I, I don't know 100%, but we're going to, like I said, kind of reevaluate the whole situation tomorrow. Were you able to help out Greg McClatt with sort of the base stealing stuff you talked about the other night? Uh, we talked some, yeah. We got a little bit uh, a chance to talk about a lot of different things. He's, you know, He seems to be very interested in learning the game and, and trying to get better, so it was fun to talk to him. With uh, Millwood and Gonzalez coming back, Millwood pitching tonight. Uh, same with Luke Scott, hit two home runs last night. Is that exciting, having all these people coming back the same time you are and then looking forward to the last game? Yeah, you know, Mike Gonzalez left me a message the other night, and he's excited to get back. We're both excited to get back. It's been a long road for a lot of us this year. It just unfortunately hasn't gone the way we would like, but Mike's getting healthy, Luke's healthy again, and Kevin said he feels good. So, you know, if we can get everybody back in one time and start to play some good baseball and and really get some momentum for the second half and try to finish as strong as possible. What are your impressions of the Bay Sox infielders? I'm impressed with the whole team. You know, they all seem to have a very good team and they swing the bats well. The defense has been outstanding. And so um, I was talking to the coaching staff. I said, you know, it looks like you guys have really put together a pretty solid team and they're excited about it. Um, you know, when I came from the Gulf Coast League and, and the level of baseball is certainly you can see the big, a big difference, and guys play great. You still haven't laid out for a ball yet. How important is it to do that before you head back to Baltimore? Uh, I'm not too worried about it. You know, I feel like I'm, I'm pretty as healthy as I've been in a long time, so I'm not too worried about it. Any changes in Prince George's Stadium since you played here in 2001? It was a long time ago. I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember too much, but it looks the same just visually, so I don't know if they've actually made any big changes or not, but everything looks pretty much the same. Are there any specific prospects here at Bowie that uh, you expect to make it to the big leagues in the next? I don't know. Yeah, it? it's just that's a it's a long, hard road, and, and there's there's still a lot of steps from here to the big leagues. And sometimes guys certainly skip AAA, but but everybody uh, everybody here has a chance. You know, I don't think there's anybody that you can you can say doesn't have a chance to play in the big leagues because you know, the more you work, and the better you get, and the more you progress. You know, you never know what's going to happen in this game. This game is crazy. You think any of these guys are as fast as you are? Oh, I'm sure several of them are faster than me. I'm old now, so <laughs> I just try. I just try to use my head more than my feet. All right, Thanks, All right. Brian. Yeah,